Belinda again from My Style Journey. Today I'm going to talk about the dreaded Birkenstocks. So I'm just going to take them off my feet and I'm going to show you what I'm talking about. Mine are the EVA Arizonas and they really are comfortable. I'm so glad that I purchased them. I'm so glad they're in my closet and I know that I'm going to be able to wear them quite a few different ways. But if you're over 50, and you wear Birkenstocks, you kind of have a look and you you have that look in your mind because we did wear Birkenstocks back in the late 90s I think it was and styles were a little bit different back then but we've aged and it's good to be able to put a very modern twist on your Birkenstock shoes. When mine arrived in the post because I ordered them online my children and my husband just said no <laughs> but i have proven them wrong and i'm wearing them in a much more stylish way so let's get into some of the looks that i've got for you today in this first look over here you will see that i'm wearing a pair of shorts <laughs> now i don't like wearing shorts on cameras but it's my body and i do wear shorts because i live in a very warm climate and I really thought that this was a lovely way to add my Birkenstocks. As you can see here, it gives it a little bit of style. It does add a little extra to the look. And although they are comfortable, my feet are comfortable, I really feel like I am on trend. And these, although they are a trend at the moment, they will stay in my closet. In this next look, I'm wearing a dress. And this is a t-shirt dress. I've just layered it. I've added a beautiful denim jackets and I just think that with the layered necklaces, the belts and the handbag, this look looks polished. It looks finished and it's a perfect look for any spring or autumn climate. I love this look. It's one of my favorites. In this next look, I think that this is one of the ways that I would wear my Birkenstocks the most. I've got a pair of black culottes on and I love the combination of the culottes with the Birkenstocks. I just think that it gives it such a beautiful style. It just finishes it off, it elevates the look, it's just beautiful. This has to be the favorite of all the looks that I'm sharing with you today. I do love this very much. The obvious way to wear Birkenstocks for me is to wear mine with my jeans. So I'm sharing two looks with you today. In this first look, I've chosen a pair of dark wash jeans. I do think that the beautiful top that I've chosen to wear with this, layered with the necklaces, just elevates those Birkenstocks a little bit, gives it a little bit of shine, puts them on show. Because the jeans are quite long and the Birkenstocks are a little bit chunky, I've decided to just roll my jeans up twice so that you can see a little bit of ankle. I don't think that you all have to do this, but because I'm very short, it sort of balances the look out a little bit for me. It makes the chunkiness of the sandals less chunky if you can see a little bit of ankle. In this next look, the jeans are a little more of a light wash. They're much more casual. I'm wearing it with a graphic tee and because I've not tucked the tee in, because I've left it out, I've knotted it to the side, which gives it a little bit of an edgy vibe. But because the T is out, I didn't want to roll up the jeans because I have a short torso, I have short legs, I'm just short everywhere. So I just, I thought that I would look too short <laughs> if I rolled the jeans up. It would just make me look a little bit boxy. So I've left the jeans all the way down to my ankles and they sort of skim the tops of my feet. But I do think that because I've left my shirt out, I can get away with wearing the Birkenstocks with this look. What do you think? Before I continue, I would just love to say that if you're not subscribed to my channel, I would love for you to consider it and hit that subscribe button below, click on the bell, and then you will get notifications of further videos that I upload. I do upload once a week at the moment, and my target audience is women over 50. So I would really love you to consider hitting that subscribe button. That out the way, 
I want to show you two more looks with lighter colors. So I don't think that you have to not wear your Birkenstocks or should I say the black Birkenstocks just with black clothing or darker clothing. So in this next look, I'm wearing them with my white jeans. So I'm wearing this shirt that is my upcycled shirt because it was a shirt dress and I'm teaming that with a pair of white jeans. This is the look that I'm wearing currently. I love this. I think it looks very casual and yet elevated. These sleeves in this look can be rolled up so I can get even a more casual vibe from this shirt and they have a little loop that can button up to the top of the shirt which gives it even a more casual vibe but I wanted to show you that it didn't need to be a completely casual look this shirt looks beautiful with these white jeans and the black Birkenstocks do not look odd at all I'm using the three color rules so I'm having the brown tones with the whites and I've added the black as my extra color I think it's a magical look it really does work what do you think in this next look I'm wearing my Birkenstocks with my Burberry pants they are a little bit cropped so there's a lot of ankle on show which helps to balance out the chunkiness of the Birkenstocks and I'm wearing it with a simple white button-down shirt I love that the collar of the shirt looks very smart around the neck it just smartens up the look I didn't tuck these in I actually tied the shirt in a knot at my waist and I just I, I honestly love the simplicity of this look and then you get the pop of black in neutral school thinks black is a pop of color but the black really does make the outfit pop I think that it elegantly puts this outfit together in the final look that I'm sharing with you I'm wearing a khaki skirt it's a viscose skirt and it has pockets it's flowy it's a midi length so there's enough space between the, the hem of the skirt and the Birkenstocks to make it look not too chunky I do think that a maxi skirt might for somebody as short as me look very chunky at the bottom I would just look very heavy and unbalanced but I'm sure that if you're a taller person than me you can get away with wearing a maxi dress or a maxi skirt with your Birkenstocks I think it would look lovely I'm wearing just a simple tee in this look and I love how the outfit has come together it just looks beautiful balanced with the black t-shirt and the black at the bottom so I really hope that this video inspired you to not shy away from getting Birkenstocks for your closet especially if you're in the southern hemisphere and you're going into summer they are a great staple in your closet I do call them a staple they are comfortable they are chic and stylish and you can really dress them up and down depending what you wear with them so these specific Birkenstocks I'm just looking exactly what they're made from they're made from ethylene vinyl acetate which is a super lightweight and flexible material and they really are that they're not sweaty on my feet my feet get enough air and airflow and I just feel comfortable in them they are well known for their comfort factor thank you so much for watching I do truly hope that I've inspired you as I have inspired myself to wear Birkenstocks with almost anything they really are comfortable and why should we just wear comfort and look frumpy we can look great we can look elevated we can look classic we can look gorgeous in our lovely stylish <laughs> easy to wear Birkenstocks this has given me as much inspiration as I hope that I'm providing for you so do come again next time and thank you so much for watching i will see you next time bye